Hey folks, Colin from Atom here. Today we're going to go over the ability of adding a Twitch advert timer on your OBS. This will automatically display on your stream alongside an automatic message to chat to notify users of them starting. You can also promote your subscription to viewers to skip adverts in the future. Before anything, you'll want to head on over to atom.tv forward slash imports. Scroll on down and hit the download next to the 3 minute ad timer. But before we get into anything OBS or Atom related, we have to configure our adverts on Twitch. Due to the automatic timing on ads not being detectable, we have to make some changes for the timer to work. Head on over to your creator dashboard on Twitch and then go to monetization and then ads. Next, we want to make sure that we've disabled the pre-roll ads. This means that you can guarantee that pre-roll ads only trigger on each hour, allowing us to track adverts easier. Next, we want to head to the ads manager. The first adjustment we want to do for our ads is to be 3 minutes per hour. We then want to disable the automatic ad length and frequency. This is so we know that the adverts are going to be 3 minutes long and ran every hour. Next, in the ad length frequency, we want to select it as 3 minutes every 60 minutes. And finally, we want to select a start delay of 1 minute. This means that for the first hour of your stream, you will not be interrupted. And if you run a starting soon screen, this means it will pretty much go unnoticed. Now it's time to head across to OBS. First of all, we want to add in a text source. This will sit next to the timer. Keep the text relatively small and set it to something like ads. Next, we want to add a browser source. Make sure you set it to 180 in width and 80 in height. And be sure to select refresh browser when scene becomes active. Hide both of these sources for the time being and load up Atom. Inside Atom, head to the rules section and click on the import export button on the top right. Select import and then drag or select the file we downloaded before. In the first step, select your OBS integration. Next, select your two sources we set up before in OBS. The first source is the text source for the advert label. The next source is for the browser source we set up for the timer. This has to be selected twice as we're setting the URL property for the source and the visibility alongside the text source. And finally, we want to set up the chat message that automatically is posted at the time of the adverts starting, letting your community know that they are running. This could also be something to promote a subscription to your channel so people don't get adverts in the future. And that's all there is to it. To test it out and to tweak sizing, you'll want to run the rule within Atom. Now you can see the timer displayed at the same time as the automatic message it posted to chat. I hope this video was helpful and if you have any questions or if you have created something very cool to show us, feel free to join the Discord or follow our Twitter. Links to both will be in the description down below.